to start off this Monday piping hot with some tea. Yes. And it turns out that, my goodness, it is a story that reads like a soap opera. Mm. But it is real life. Check this out. People Magazine is reporting that singer-actress Noah Cyrus, younger sister to Miley, and actor Dominic Purcell were once seeing each other, like a friends with benefits situation. But then he went on to see and then marry her mother, <laughs> Tish Cyrus. <laughs> Who was the diamond? I oh, told you the oh, tea is hot. Oh. Pick me, pick me, pick me. Pick me. <laughs> this is so juicy. First of all, I'm gonna say this out loud. Tish is a narcissist mother who is in competition with her daughter. Just let that sit there. Okay, okay, okay. okay. I'll give you the timeline. So, apparently, Dominic slid into the DMs of one Tish back in 2016, but she didn't touch him because she was married. Then she said in 2022 on the Call Her Daddy podcast that he that she was free, and she was like, you know what? I'm going to shoot my shot because now I'm free and single. Problem is, the way she's telling the story just sounds like two people who finally just had a chance to hook up because she finally divorced her husband. Truth is, her daughter, Noah, was dating Dominic, and she knew that. By the way, just a, just a side note, Noah and Dominic 30 year age difference. 30. But she did not care that her daughter, she cared that she was married and she didn't want to talk to him then, but it didn't seem to bother her at all that her daughter had a boyfriend and she infiltrated and started dating this but man. But they were broken up when she started seeing him. No, according to the reports, they were together. And she knew that they were dating. She knew. That's another thing. She knew that they were dating. So this, to me, speaks to a mother who is in competition with her daughter. Also, a little bit of salacious tea that I also heard. Apparently, at the wedding, uh, Noah was not invited, surprise, surprise. And they hired security to make sure just in case she showed up, she couldn't do anything. So that to me speaks volumes about the relationship between mother and daughter. And Ooh. a politician, narcissist, I said it. <laughs> okay, Ooh, the tea is hot. Can you guys imagine, though, uh, being like, you know, I'm not far off from their ages, from <laughs> Noah and Dominic, they're like 54 and 56. Can you imagine blowing up your life for lust? No. <laughs> like, mm. I, I'm not saying I don't have moments where I'm lustful. <laughs> uh, I certainly do, but the idea, like, the idea of just blowing it up, just lighting it on fire. No. And dating the guy who was with your daughter, which is it's my icky. Icky. Yeah. It's mind it's blowing. Icky. Yeah, it's really icky, icky for some, but also it's like a tab on a lot of web pages for others. <laughs> you know? Like, for, it is. But I guess that's in the sort of like, now you're talking about like what can fall into the fantasy realm that you would never want to happen in reality and then what mm. reality is. And I, for me, everyone's had that experience where you're in an early relationship, okay, you don't know the person that well. And I don't know about you, maybe this is only me, I don't think though. so though. When you have like a running commentary going in your head, mm -hmm. during, you're getting on, getting it on, getting hot and heavy and you're like, oh, is, is he into this? Does he like this move? Does she, is, how's my body looking in this position? Yeah. The last thing you want to enter your head when you're having that narrative of thought <gasps> and you're trying to get back into uh -oh. things is, I wonder if I'm as good as my daughter. <laughs> yeah. Back to my point, she's in competition with her daughter. She's like, yeah, so gross. Whatever's happening, I know I'm better than Noah. That's okay, so gross. Okay, so what if we talk about, what if we talk about, I think his name is Dominic, okay? The guy, Dom. Let's put yeah. it on him for a second. Is there a narrative where we flip it and we put it on him? So take Tish and Noah outside of it for just a second. Gotcha. You know, we always talk about women being clout chasers, social climbers. He's not, he's like a D-list actress, at, actor at best. Mm. Maybe he was like going through the Noah to get to the Tish because he's a clout chaser. Oh. And maybe, and maybe, just maybe, he has a type. <laughs> and, <laughs> and maybe his type, they just all well, look they like look the Cyruses. <laughs> I did, and, okay. Here's what I, I will say. I did date two brothers once. Is that, is that okay? Uh, do right. tell. So, was there, a, wait, wait a second. Was there a gap? How much of a gap in time was there between one brother and the other brother? And, and do who you was have better? photos? <laughs> and who was better? <laughs> I think there was a, like maybe a two year separation. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh. We're okay with that? I think so. Okay, all right, all right. Okay, all right. but did you in your head in the times compare? No. Uh, let's move on. Oh. Oh. Hey there, what did you think? Drop your comments below and join the conversation. And don't forget to like and subscribe so you can find more on everything from food and fashion to pop culture and current events. See you soon.